Hey guys, what's going on? MJ Madness here, and today I put together a video of all the 0.9.0 update features as of today. So this should be pretty cool, and I spend a lot of time on this, so please leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoy. So first off, new world creation options. So for one, infinite worlds are going to be added, which will be super cool in the, as you can see here, a couple pictures of what worlds will look like infinitely, which is going to be so, 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 so awesome. And not only that, you can choose small, medium, and large, if you don't want infinite, and super flat worlds, as you can see above. And next up, our next change is PC generation. Now, PC generation means things like rivers, caves, villages, um, abandoned mine shafts, and strongholds. Those are a couple pictures of strongholds, which is going to be awesome. New biomes. So there are a ton of new biomes. So we have the jungle, the mesa, the plains, uh, roof forest, savanna, taiga, extreme hills, and the mushroom island. Which And n brand new trees are going to be added. So first off, we have um, the jungle trees, dark oak trees, acacia trees, and giant mushrooms, which can be found in the mushroom biome. And that's, the Mushroom Island's going to be so cool. As well, new mobs. There's a ton of new mobs in the update. So, our first mob that we have, we got, well, or villagers, which is going to be really cool. Villagers aren't really smart. Like, their AI isn't as good and they can't trade. But we do have villagers as well, which is going to be cool. But, once again, the villagers can't trade. We have wolves and also ocelots, but they haven't shown a picture of that yet. Uh, wolves and ocelots will be really cool to have in the game. And then we have mushrooms, which can be found on the Mushroom Island. Endermen, slimes, and silverfish. You can kind of see it in the background. I'll zoom in a bit so you guys can see it. Right there, that's a silverfish. It's pretty cool. And there is the end portal, but it doesn't work. It's just for show, I guess. Maybe in future updates they'll make it work. And also we have brand new blocks. So here's a photo of some of the blocks we will be getting. So those blocks include mob spawners, hardened clay, and all 16 colors of stained clay. Uh, mycelium in the mushroom biomes. Red sand, I missed that. Uh, Podzol right here, which is going to be cool. Find that in the taiga. Andesite, diorite. And granite, which are brand new types of stone. And we have end stone and packed ice. And th which is just different from ice. And as well in new blocks, we have uh, just a bunch of new flowers. Like sunflowers, stuff like that. Uh, peonies. And they're getting rid of the old blue flower. Hopefully we see it back in future updates. And then vines, lily pads, and cocoa beans will be added. Finally, there's a couple of changes to the game. So first off, one that I'm kind of disappointed in, beds no longer restore health. As well, improved mob AI, which means they're smarter, about as smart as the PC version, which will be nice. Yeah, just put that up there. And a brand new crafting screen, which is going to be cool, because you can, and no one really knows how it'll work yet, but that will be cool. And, yeah, as you can see, maybe you just tap or drag. And and I know you're wondering about the release date. People say around June. If you enjoy, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching, guys.